There are many videos on how to make graphite powder, but it seems very time consuming and messy, so I thought there must be a simpler way. I start by first taking a graphite block and place it in a thick plastic bag. Then I put on some safety glasses and use a hammer lightly to break the block up into smaller chunks. If I was to do this again, I would do it outside on a more solid surface and use two bags in case the first one splits. The first thing I'm going to try is a pepper grinder. I remove the top and pour the chunks in. Replace it and start grinding. Surprisingly this works and produces a nice fine powder. Now for the Nutribullet. I pour the remaining chunks in and screw on the lid. Now I am using what they call the milling blade to do this. I only use short pulses to start with and you can hear the graphite rattling around. And I just keep doing this until the rattling noise stops. I will point out that this is an old blade and cup that I'm using to do this. As with the pepper grinder this also produces a nice smooth powder. And again surprisingly this works really well. Just as a comparison I use another block over a file. Again the powder is fine, but this would take some time, and it definitely makes a mess. I now take a piece of cotton wool and try each of the powders in turn. Because I use Caran d'Ache pencils, I also use the Caran d'Ache block to make the powder, as this will guarantee consistency. I have to say that all three methods produced a fine powder that is easy to work with and it can also be applied with either a blending stump or a brush. Now, I have never used graphite powder before, so I will be interested to see how this works in a picture. This was a bit of an experiment, but I'm glad to say that it worked out well. So thank you for watching, and if you have tried any other methods to make this, then why not let me know in the comments section below.